Hi, and welcome to Data Explorer's daily video update for October the 15th. My name is Ruby McCormack. First, let's take a look at the market overview. The Desley Global 50, which tracks a change in short interest for the 50 largest global companies, was up 2%. All regional markets saw gains with the exception of Japan. The US and UK rose by 3%, with, U- with Asia following closely behind up 2%. Europe saw a very slight rise, and Japan was down by 1%. The earnings season has opened with a steady stream of positive and healthy figures in the U.S. European markets are focused on further earnings announcements. The dollar continued to slump, reaching a new form 14-month low. Commodities continue to rise, with oil leading the way and reaching new highs of the year. Gold has also seen some profit-taking, following its recent record strength. Now look at the upcoming earnings and economic announcements. Industrial production figures and the Consumer Sentiment Survey are due from the U.S. today. Earnings figures are due from Prosperity Bank Shares, Metro Bank Corp and Quidel. Prosperity Bank Shares has seen a decrease in its short base, which is currently at 12%. The short base for Metro Bank Corp has seen a sharp rise in its short base, which is reaching 5%. Quidel saw a decline in its short base earlier this month from 10 to 9%. We have no economic announcements for Europe today. However, we expect an interim management statement from Blue Bay Asset Management in the UK. The short base for Blue Bay Asset Management is rising and stands at 2%. Bunzel released their second interim management statement. The short base for Bunzel has seen a decline, which is now at 5%. In France, we expect sales figures from Safran. The short base for Safran has seen a sharp decline in its short base recently, falling from 4% to less than 1%. Finally, we don't anticipate any major earnings announcements today from Asia. That's the news for today. For more information, please go to our website at www.dataexplorers.com. For detailed short base information on some of the stocks mentioned here today, or for any stocks that have seen unusual shorting activity, please subscribe to our daily reports and research service at www.dataexplorers.com forward slash e-mail. Thanks for listening and have a great day.